Hello, technical test and video instruction general about how to use uh, original Turbo Decoder HU101 to made for open door trunk ignition locks of uh, Ford, Range Rover, Land Rover, Jaguar and Volvo. Basically those cars use that key profile HU101. The two come in this transport box. Inside you found the turbo decoder company trademark uh, certificate the turbo decoder and two setup devices for reset your pins and to start the procedure. So this is the profile. This is tension wheel with hologram, our company logo, serial number, signs of authenticity. And here at the back, again, company, uh, model of the color, serial number, and uh, exactly for what key profile is made. At the side, we have stop points and lines on the pump wheel. On these two, the pins now are ready for operation. They are all in maximum position. The thing we have to do is to push to the front. The pin access gate commanded by that wheel and to rotate the back wheel all the way to the right. Then I will make a test of that original Volvo 2014. Now the problem is how to insert the tool, like this or oppositely. In other words, with four holes up or six holes up. Let's see what is correct. Stay at the right, push at the front, gently and carefully insert the tool all the way into the lock. Two fingers here and pull back this handle. You will see the stop points. In that moment, you have to apply tension to the left on the front wheel and look about the orientation, how to discover it. Left tension and start to rotate the back wheel. You will feel here empty turn, easy, and then resistance. If the resistance is much before one, it means that the tool is correctly inserted. On the other side, if we reverse the tool and insert it, pull back, uh, push uh, tension to the right, sorry, to the left, and start rotate the back wheel, but keep the tension. Now you feel much more empty or easy turning on that back wheel. And you see the line come almost at one or bypass one. Uh, other words, this is not correctly orientated to, and if you start the procedure now, obviously you will not open. Extract, reverse, insert again. Check, yes, that is. And the procedure, you have to apply tension left, uh, right and left and right and left, and here pump tension, rotate the back wheel till the line come to the first stop sector. Stop here, turn back, lose the tension, check the lock, tension to the left, stop at one again, turn back and check. You have to repeat that stop point at one, more or less 20 times. Every time stop at one. If you make 20 pumps, 20 stops at one, and the lock doesn't open, you have to increase the rotation and make another series of 20 stops on the second sector. Again, right and left tension, as on the first one you have made. If you miss the opening also here, go to the third sector, repeat the tension, left and right, and that is the entire procedure. If you make 20 here, 20 here, and 20 here, and the, the lock is not open, 
the thing you have to do is to extract the two, reset the pins and try again. As you see, we have turned the lock on the first stop sector. Easy code and that is the reason for that fast opening. To extract the two from the lock, the lock come in neutral lock position, vertical, rotate all the way to the right the back wheel and push the front wheel forward till it's make click and go all in to the main handle. Only in that conditions here of the handle you can extract the tool from the lock. Pull back and you can see some pins have changed their position. This is high, this also, but this one is a little bit deep. Also this, this a little bit. And here at the, along the key blade, if you move a little bit forward this one, you can see reference lines. Here on that line, initial line, is cut number one. The pin, top of the pin, if go to the first line is cut number two, the second line is cut number three and this pin is cut number three. This one is cut number two. If you know that, you can also read the code of the key. But for this reading, you need a lot of experience. To open uh, ignition, after, the open, after you open the door, you can go and if the car has a mechanical ignition, you can orientate and simply turn the ignition. Or you can directly uh, open the ignition by reset the tool. Reset procedure is like this. Push to the front, turn to the right. And here through the holes, only with that specifically calibrated device, you have to inject that needle into the hole, in each individual hole and simply push. There is no other way to reset the pins. This is only way to do that without destroying your tool. Because uh, we have seen people making this and trying from here to reset the pin, the pin flip out and the tool remain useless. When you finish uh, that reset procedure, you can visually check the pins and you will see all of them in maximum high position. And uh, that is uh, the way you have applied the procedure. Please train, follow the steps and I hope that you are happy with your original Turbo Decoder product. Thank you for your attention and good luck.